everybody, it's Heather with Diamonds and Dragonflies, and I am here today with an unboxing of a new to me diamond art, sh art shop. So this is a diamond painting shop that I uh, discovered through a friend of mine. So thank you, Shell, owner of Black Dahlia Diamond Art. She gave me um, a heads up about a company that she found and she ordered from. Uh, they were a sponsor, I do believe, for the Miss and Stars event that I never got around to purchasing from. And when I first found them, I wanted to do my due diligence. So I saw some licensed artwork from some various artists. And I reached out to some of them to make sure that they were licensed with this company. And I received a resounding, oh, yes, we are. So I was like, wow, okay, I'm sold. So this company is on Etsy. Their name is Diamond Art Emporium. They will be linked below and there will be a link to their Etsy shop. And the owner, Ren, actually reached out to me um, after my order to thank me for my order, to let me know when I should roughly expect it. And guys, I got it 24 hours later. Um, no joke. Now, he does have two different... Um, sections I guess you could say to order from premium kits and pre-order kits the pre-order kits are made to order they come from China and are shipped here and then you get them I have not purchased any of those I need to I want to see what the time frame is going to be as to how long it takes for them to arrive uh, I did order from their premium ready to go uh, kits of ones that were in stock and ready to go. One of them I got to choose whether I wanted square or round. The other one I did not get a choice. So I don't know what is going to be in here. Uh, it did not say whether it was round or square. Doesn't really matter um, because I love the artwork. So I don't know if that's because that's the only thing he had left. Like maybe he sold out of either the squares or the rounds and so I'm getting what's left. Or maybe it's because that one was only offered in one and it just, it could be on there and I missed it. Um, it's quite possible. I'm not saying that it wasn't listed there. I didn't see it. We'll put it that way. So I'm really excited to get into this. One of the things that really intrigued me was she said, whatever you do, make sure you order a toolkit. So I was like, um, okay. She's like, he has the most amazing toolkits and with his toolkits, he sponsors so many other small shops. And I was like, okay, you just sold me again. Um, I paid $49 for each of these kits. The total was $87.98. There was no shipping cost. And there was no tax that was charged on them. Um, I don't know if the tax is already figured into the price of the Diamond Art uh kit but I am super super excited I have split it open I did do a quick peek inside and what I saw holy cow guys I can't wait to open the rest of this Atlas was so excited that he actually grabbed the toolkit portion which you will see in a minute and started to drag it across the room I was like okay dude mine you need to stop so <laughs> I tell you guys, he is he wants to share the spotlight. That is 100% for sure. So I figured I better do this sooner than later because I don't want him stealing my toolkit and then my uh, tools and my, my kits and running off with them. Next thing I know, I'm going to find him sitting at my desk diamond painting. So uh, currently, him and his sister are both laying in the dog bed in the art room, um, just chilling and laying back and being all sleepy. So I'm sure he will decide at some point in time to interrupt the video or later he will tell me that I did it all wrong. So hopefully my greatest critic, Atlas, will be impressed with this video. So guys, let's get into this. I will be right back. All right guys, I am back. I wanted to resituate myself, resituate the tripod. And of course I needed to grab my tumbler to make sure that I'm being properly hydrated during this video. Um, my tumbler today says Just Breathe with a bunch of gnomes on it. Let me give you a quick look. It's very, very cute. I bought this 
back at the beginning of the year when I had decided to do the event, Just Breathe. This was not an official or anything like that, but this one comes from Butterfly Kisses Customs. So I do purchase, I have tumblers from four different companies and Butterfly Kisses Customs is one of them. They have a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of designs to choose from. You can also get stuff on journals, you can get it on coffee mugs, you can get it on t-shirts, sweatshirts, blankets, the whole nine yards of everything. Um, I will let you know that Butterfly Kisses Customs, their orders take a long time, like three to five weeks long time. So you're not gonna get them in a quick turnaround. Um, I don't know if that's because everything is done by a third party. Um, I don't know if that's the case or not, I, I truly don't. Or if she's just so busy that it takes that long, I don't know whether she has another full-time job. I don't know. I just wanna let you know that when you do order, know that it's gonna take probably close to a month. Sometimes it's actually taking me a little more than a month to get my order, so just as an FYI. Me, on the other hand, I have plenty of tumblers to keep me busy and occupied and drinking from, so I'm good with the weight. All right, guys, this is what I saw inside. Look at this. Look at this. This is what Atlas tried to steal. So we're gonna take this out first. It came packaged. Um, this was all attached inside this bubble wrap, but um, Mr. Atlas decided that he was gonna do other stuff with it. And then inside that is still our kits. So we'll get to that in a minute and I'll show you how those were packaged. So this was laid out like this and it was all like taped together that it made like this big, huge train. Let me zoom you out a little bit. There you go. So this is what I saw. And I was like, holy Batman guys, this is a lot. So let's dig in. So this is definitely a company that you might very well want to grab a toolkit from because I think you're going to get lots and lots of goodies. All right, what do we got here? Wow. Okay, so we have a bright red nylon bag. We've got a little bubble wrap with some stuff. And then holy cow, that is a very large tray. Uh, sorry for the ring light glare, but that is the largest tray I have ever seen in my entire existence on this planet. All right. So, um, built-in tumbler, and are you kidding me? Is this two? Okay, guys, this is technically two trays, but they fit inside each other to, and then this seat. Okay, so it's two trays in one, and they sit inside each other and seal each other off. But then you have two trays, and these are humongous. That is really cool. I have never seen anything like that before. So that is very snifty. Okay, there is nothing on here telling me what company this is from. So guys, if you have seen trays like this, let me know in the comments because I wanna know. All right, so we've got that. Um, Anti-slip mat. I've never actually used one of these. I don't know whether or not they um, really do work to hold and keep your diamond painting trays from moving. Um, I know some people use it when they do an easel to keep their their diamond painting tray on the easel. I would think that the drills would roll down, but I don't know. We're gonna try that out, all right? So that will be a future um, experiment. Okay, here we go. This is boot. Oh my God, these are all cover minders, guys. All right, I'm gonna bring you in. Look at these. I've got a little black cat, a little jack-o'-lantern. We've got a spider with a witch hat on and a little ghost with his tongue hanging out. That is flipping amazing. That is awesome. And it says Diamond Art Emporium. That is really neat and cool, guys. Okay, I'm, I'm super impressed. Super, super, super impressed. All right, we're gonna put that off to the side. And then, oh my God. Um, this is more cover binders. These are just silver circles, but this one he's added a spider to. That is super cool. So I got seven cover binders with this kit. Wow. And everything is themed Halloween. Like it says boo. Uh, the kits say happy Halloween. We've got Halloween clip, um, 
you know, cover minders over here. Now I did not order anything Halloween. Neither one of these kits are Halloween kits, but he did just drop a whole ton of Halloween kits. Okay, this is really cool that they use this little nylon drawstring bag. And what do, what do we have in here? Holy cow, that's a lot of stuff. Okay, so we have, all right, two more of your basic simple trays, okay? Um, we've got some plain orange washi. We've got, okay, these are plastic, so there's plastic tweezers. Uh, let me, there we go, that's a little better. Plastic tweezers. Um, okay, we have Dream Wax Studio diamond-shaped wax grandma's kitchen fragrance version 2.0 oh that smells really good all right so he's giving a sample of dream wax comes with so that's one of the companies that he is partnering with that is awesome i love that love that and then guys this is not your standard pen this is a um upgraded like acrylic pen these are like the ones that you can buy. I've seen these on um, similar ones on Diamond Art Club. I've seen similar ones on Amazon. Um, unfortunately, this is still way too small for my hand with my arthritis and nerve damage, but I've never seen a company offer a pen like this. And with one, two, three, four, there's four multi-placers in here, guys. Four multi-placers. Um, this, though, is the perfect size thickness for my daughter. So uh, the daughter is going to love that. Wow. Okay. Super, super cool. I am really impressed. Got a straightener. Get out. Okay. Very cool. And I was literally just saying the other day that I needed to get one of these. Um for when I'm in Elizabeth Ward containers and I only need like three or four drills. That, okay, you read my mind. That is amazing. All right. So guys, literally out of that toolkit, these are the only things that I wouldn't use. I mean, I'm not gonna use this, but this is a great gift. Um, and Oh, no, I'm sorry. I won't use these tweezers. I mean, they look like they work perfectly fine. I just prefer my metal ones. I like my murder tweezers. Um, that is really cool. And I am super stoked that you get to try out Dream Wax. Now, I have Dream Wax already, but that's amazing for anyone that has never tried Dream Wax before. All right, we're going to set that to the side. And this, guys, this in of itself, this is blowing my mind. But I need to find out what company that is from. Um, when I do, I will let you know whether it's something that I add to the description here. Um, if I find out before this video goes live, um, I will add a little clip at the end and let you guys know. All right. Um, so I am going to reach out and find out that information. All right. Then this was in the middle. Push here to open. Okay. Um, Diamond Art Emporium, push here. Okay, I'm pushing here to open. What? What is What is this? Um, what in God's green earth? <gasps> there is enough specials to replace all of the standard drills per color. Do a few, do them all, your choice. Are you kidding me right now? Are you kidding me? Okay. Guys, I got sent one, two, three, four, five, six, six sets of ABs that I can replace all of them in this kit. This is one of my kits I got called Chameleon. And then this is the other one, Hanali. And this is five. So there's five in there for Hanali. Oh my God. Guys, I am literally sitting here flabbergasted. I literally paid $87.98 for the entire order, for the whole thing. Um, I know I haven't gotten to the kits yet, so I'm, I'm, I'm reserving judgment, but holy Batman. Okay, I set that to the side. 
Heather needs to calm down and relax here. Okay, we've got one more toolkit. Let's see if it's identical or if we got anything different or new. Um, oh, I can already tell you we got different cover minders. All right, let's move that off to the side. Let's look at this first. Uh, guys, I am, wow. <laughs> I, I don't even know what to say. I am, holy cow. Okay. Oh my God. Oh my God. Um, okay, so this one I got a haunted house. Let me bring you in so you guys can see. We got another jack-o'-lantern. Is it the same face? I mean, it's not a big deal if it is. I'm just curious. Um, yes, okay. But this one has a haunted house, a black ghost, and a witch's hat. So guys, look at, I got a total of eight Halloween cover minders. Seven of them are different from each other. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna be having super, super fun with Frankly Spooky. That is amazing. All right, and then Remember how I got the silver ones on the last one? This one, I got purple roses and then purple. These are gems. These are like the gems that you buy in bags. These are gemstones. Wow. Those are beautiful. Those purple glitter roses. Those are stunning. Okay. <laughs> I am really overwhelmed right now. I can't believe this. Oh my God, guys, I got a confetti tray and it has individual um, stoppers. Does this pull up? How, how does this work? Um, do I lift these? Um, yes, okay, here we go. They pull out, let me zoom you out a little bit. But guys, this is a six half semicircle um, confetti tray and it's even got a little like handheld thing um, so you can you know like do that or for me it would be this wow okay I, I don't I don't even know what to say <laughs> I'm just like blown away um, all right so we have the the red bag let me I need to pull this a little closer. Uh, there we go. All right, that's better. I feel like I'm stretching across everything. So what do we got here? Oh, I got a different colored pen. Um, I see some different colored things here, guys. Okay, so we've got more orange washi, okay. Um, this is a foldable spoon that snaps into place. Okay, that's really cool. That is really nifty. We've got another straightener. Okay, we've got two more of those trays. Um, this is a orange diamond, and this one is orange creamsicle. Okay, so I got a different smell of Dream Wax. Oh, that smells really good. That smells really, really good. Um, we got metal tweezers this time. Okay, angled metal tweezers. We got a little brush. Um, this is for brushing your drills if any of them get stuck in the thing. And then guys, we have a green pen this time around. So just like the blue one, except this one is green and you get the four um, multi-placers, plastic multi-placers. Wow. Okay. This, I truly don't know what to say. I am blown away. And guys, this didn't cost me any extra. Like this didn't increase the price of the kits. Um, hell, at this point, even if the kits are eh, the toolkits were worth the price. It's just amazing. All right, here we go, guys. Look at how this was packaged. So they're not in boxes, they are rolled, but they have this um, Happy Halloween sticker that's holding this uh, wrapping of Halloween tool around them. So let's go and pull these out. So there's one and there's two. Wow, this one's heavy. 
Okay. But yeah, this was wrapped around it. Get rid of the box. But isn't that cool? The presentation is amazing. I am blown away by the presentation. All right, let's look at this one first. So it's wrapped around and then a little paw print sticker holding the bubble wrap closed. And then we've got a kit and we've got our drills. Guys, I'm not even angry that there's no, um, whatchamacallit, um, uh, box. <laughs> I have my storage tubes now, so, um, okay. I haven't seen drills packaged like this in like forever. Um, I do not know whether it said these were resin drills or acrylic. Um, the last time I got drills packaged like this, okay, this is a square. I mean, these look fantastic. I'm not seeing any trash in there or misshapen. Everything looks like uniform in size. So I'm not seeing any ugliness. This is $37.99. This is like the color I'm going to paint my walls this weekend. Um, or the accent wall, we'll put it that way. These look awesome. But I am leaning towards the fact that these might be acrylic versus resin, but I don't know that. I do not know that for sure. So um, I'm going to be, I'm going to go look that up. I will be right back. Okay, guys, um, I couldn't find anything on the website to say whether they were acrylic or resin. I did send a message out to the um, owner. So if he gets back to me before I put this up, then I will let you know. Uh, all right, so we got, okay, so we get a legend. Um, and they've checked off all the bags of how many we should have received. There's the DMC color, the symbol, and then the quantity. So, okay. So looking at these symbols, I'm gonna have to just be a little careful on some of these. So we've got a capital M, a capital R, but then we have a lowercase m, a pound sign, a percent sign, capital P, capital N, capital F, capital D, a zero. Then we've got, is that a slash or a seven? Slash, okay, so we've got slash plus, capital Y, eight, capital J, capital L, lowercase a, question mark, number four, the uh, less than, sign, the equals, capital E, nine, dollar sign, capital U, capital T, seven, the at symbol, number one, uh, parentheses going both ways, left and right, don't like that, uh, capital V, then we've got the ampersand, a capital C, six, five, three, two, we've got a W, capital W, w capital A, lowercase e, capital K, capital Q, Lowercase b, greater than sign, lowercase d, is that it? Oh, nope. And then we've got a capital X, a capital B, capital H, and a capital G. So the symbols leave a little to be desired with some of these. Um, so it is gonna need to be something that you take extra special care of. I'm not seeing a sticker sheet, so unless it's rolled up in the thing, you might have to use this to do your stickers. Um, there's an awfully big gap between these two, the DMC and the symbol. So let's see if there's a, a sticker sheet before I say anything, because then I might have to actually um, take a picture, print it out on my um, computer so that I can cut and paste and put them closer together. So I'm trying to carefully cut through. Um, okay, so it's got a wrapping around it. All right. There is a styrofoam tube in here, keeping this rolled up, okay? Some of the kits, Atlas is over here getting ready to steal the, the box. Some of the kits, let me move these out of the way. Um, you had a choice in sizes. 
This one you did not, I don't believe. I think there was only one size. Ooh, it looks really nice. Okay, I'm gonna roll it. Uh, this is not a soft lint background. This is a nylon. Um, kind of reminds me of like uh, Diamond Dots and Leisure Arts and Make Market, etc. All right, let's zoom out. Look at this, guys. This is beautiful. This is Chameleon. Dog Dad Diamond Art. And he's beautiful. All right, we're going to get rid of these. This is all poured glue wrinkles. So we're going to pull back our plastic cover to about the halfway mark. This is a 50 by 50. Um, it is a thin plastic cover, but it does seem to be good quality that it's not like ripping or tearing on me. So that's good. I'm definitely thinking that as far as kits go, that this kind of falls into the budget kit realm. Even though, yes, it was $49 for the kit. But I mean, guys, did you see that tool kit? Wow. Okay. Perfect. See, all the wrinkles are gone. It was just in the plastic cover. So we do have, let's take a tour of the canvas. Let's zoom in. Oh, he's so cute. Okay, so we've got Dog Dad, Dog Dad Diamond Art. Chameleon 50 by 50. We've got a thumbnail and a legend on this side. Uh, let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. So there's 49 colors in this kit. Um, there's nothing along the bottom edge. It is blank. And then we have on the lower left side, we have another legend. Uh, let's zoom in and let's take a look at the canvas. There are grid lines, which is totally okay. I love that. I actually prefer that. These symbols look really clear, guys. Really super clear. You're just gonna have to be careful with like six and nine, the lesser than and the greater than sign, especially if you go to flip it over. But I did notice that they're all different colors, so they're not similar colors so that you can get um, adjusted to that. But I mean, the symbols look really, really good. I'm not seeing any complaints there. Let's do a glue test. All right, you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Totally okay. The ten made it for me. It's just got to make it to the ten. Um, I still had to shake it a little to get it to come off. So I am totally okay with that. Um, this is what the canvas looks like, but then this is what the kit is going to look like. So this is like a photo negative, and then it's going to be this bright and cheery, plus we got the six ABs to add in. That's going to be awesome. So I am really excited about kitting this up and getting this started. Really, really excited about that. I don't know that I'm going to get this done this year. Um, my my plate is kind of full at the current moment with the holidays upcoming. But you can guarantee that this is going to be at the top of my list of things to do next month. And who knows, I might decide to kit up and do it this year anyway. All right, I'm going to put this to the side and let's take a look at my next kit. All right, guys. So the next kit that we have here is a much bigger one. This one is a 75 by 50 and it is another dragon guys. It's a dragon for me to add to my dragon supply. And let's bring this down. I'm going to sit down. Oh, standing is 
really hard for me these days. The past couple of days have not been fun for me pain-wise. Um, But there's the image, guys. Look at that. This is Hana Lee. Oh, this is so amazing. This is so beautiful. And here we go with our colors and our symbols. And let's see. Four on that page. So 46 colors this time. Very similar symbol wise. So I'm not really seeing, I mean, they're, they're mixed up and not in the same exact order as they were. There is a process. There are um, instructions on how to do it down here. So that does exist. And we have two pages. There's four on the back. But it tells you how many bags. There's 35 bags of black in this one, guys. But then there's 33 bags of 823. 44 of 939. So we've got a lot of bags. I mean, those are the little tiny ones. You know, these came in this little small train. I haven't seen those in quite a while. So um, let me... All right, where's my little slicer and dicer here to very carefully all right so we can pull that off and then we're gonna pop this out maybe okay that doesn't want to come out okay guys let me stand up here I'm gonna have to unroll this and then pull it out there we go. We got that out. Let me move our drills. Gotta make sure I don't mix them up. And then I'm going to lay this down. I don't think I need to roll this one. Guys, look at this. Oh my gosh. Look at him. Oh, he's gorgeous. Now, this one has a lot of color blocking. There's a lot. Well, no, that is actually multiple symbols. But there is some color blocking over in here. The other one had a lot of confetti. This one has a, a mixture of both. Let's uh, get this straightened out. Now this one might end up being one of my monthly dragons. I'm not sure. He's he's no couch potato though. He's no teeny tiny kit. Not that, you know, all of my dragons have been small. All right, we got all the wrinkles out of that side. We're gonna spin them around. I have to say, guys, this is, I really enjoy this part, so. All right, and there he is, guys. Yeah, there's one in here that I didn't, I didn't get. Let me see. Blue is sticking fast to me on this one. All right. There we go. Oh, he's so beautiful. He is going to be gorgeous. Once again, photo negative. There's what he's really going to look like. Oh, he's going to be gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. I am loving him. So guys, there we go. This is Diamond Art Emporium. We've got our two images here, Hanalee and our chameleon. Um, 
I am super stoked, super, super stoked to try these out. Uh, we've got our drills for that one. We've got our drills for this one. And then, of course, we've got this massive, amazing toolkit um, and all these goodies that this came with. I mean, guys, this is just kind of blowing my mind uh, with everything that came with these kits. It's just it's just breathtaking. I can't even I can't even get over it. You know, how much stuff we got and what all came with this. I'm loving that he truly uh gives you a boutique kind of feel with all of the extras. That is just super super amazing. And I am very intrigued and excited to give these kits a try. Um, I, I don't know what else to say. Yes, they are not your standard premium kits that a lot of us have come to respect and uh, expect in the diamond painting community. But these are, these are quality kits, guys. They are quality kits. They are sized perfectly as far as I can see. I don't see where there's going to be any issue with them being clear or pixelated. Um, I know that he is actually licensing with the artists because I have spoken. He's got quite a few Cheryl Carpenters on his site and I did speak to Cheryl and she told me that yes, she has given him permission to license her artwork. Um, so I know it's all above board. No, it's above board. So I did not get a response about, by the time I finish this, whether the drills are resin or acrylic. I'm gonna go with probably acrylic. I haven't seen drills packaged this way in a very long time. And the last time that I did, they were acrylic. Not a huge deal, guys. They look super sparkly, they look even. Um, I'm not really worried about that. Um, we've just all come to expect resin now. So I don't know that it makes a really huge difference. I worked with nothing but acrylics for a year and a half, almost two years of my diamond painting life. So I'm not super worried about that. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you give it a thumbs up. Uh, go check them out. See if there's anything there you like. I am going to try and get to one of these sooner than later so that I can give you a post review as to what it was like to work on the kit um, before you, you run off and start spending your own money. Um, obviously, you're more than welcome to, to go out and do that, but I will get back to you on what I found working on these kits and I will let you know my thoughts and feelings about them. So until next time, guys, remember... Without the darkness, we'd never get to see the stars. Hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you later. Bye.